Welcome back, everyone. Where we, and by we, I mean myself, Chuckles, and Samuel here, are in sleepy old Riverwood. Where we just narrowly survived a dragon attack, and a beheading, all in one day. I was going to say all before lunchtime, but it's almost 3 o'clock already, so I guess that wouldn't be true. Anyway, we are standing here in front of Alvor and Sigrid's house. We just came from the inside where Elvor helped us by giving us a number of items. And he could not help us by, I'm gonna favorite some of these items while I'm talking. He could not help us by getting us on a carriage back to High Rock, but he sent us on Oh, that's a very fancy book. He sent us on a mission. A mission to go and talk to the Jarl. What? Be careful of what? Relax. Anyway, he sent us on a mission to visit the Jarl of Whiterun, which apparently is a town not too far from here. We could check the map. We have a map. It's very exciting. Uh, here's, oh, that's Helgen. That's where we came from. We are in Riverwood right here. And I guess we're going over here, just to the north a little bit. Um, Elvor wants us to talk to, oh, I've, I've made a mistake there with my keys. I'm sorry. Okay, now we can leave that. Okay, there. Sorry about that. Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. Uh, Alvor wants us to go to Whiterun to tell the Jarl about the dragon attack and yada yada and save our town and whatever. We, and by we I mean me, are going to... What is that guy doing? Anyway, we are going to Whiterun to have a chat with the Jarl about potentially getting back home to High Rock. But before we do that, I've decided I'm going to spend a little time here in Riverwood, sell some junk, and... Maybe pick up a few essentials for the trip and such. So let's start off with you. May the gods watch over your battle, friend. All right, thank you for that. Um, right. None of these things. Here, didn't I already ask you why the Thalmor are allowed to arrest people? Never mind, that's fine. Uh, I need to sell you some junk that I'm not gonna use. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Okay, thank you. All right, well I'm, uh, I'm gonna go through and do this and we'll be back in a shortly. All right, so he didn't really have anything worth buying. Well, actually, he had a lot of things worth buying, but I don't really have the gold. He had a steel sword, which I really, really wanted, but it was too expensive. And he also had some leather boots, which would be really nice to replace my fur boots, but 
again, quite expensive. However, I noticed there's a few options here. At the bottom, my good blacksmith, I am in need of your crafting expertise, or could you temper... Oh, All right. I'm not done. Whatever you need. Could you temper All my right. armor, Simply hone my draw. weapon, or are I you handy draw. with a tanning rack? Uh, these are from a mod. I just kind of want to check out and see what they do. Like, are you handy with a tanning rack? What does that do? Let's hmm. find out. Ah, Alvor seems ready to take my order. So, he can make me some tents... A bandana. Okay, I don't think so. Frissa the Wide's Nordic Tailoring. Oh, yeah, okay. Fur crafting kit he could make. Ooh, or he could make some cloaks. He could make me a linen traveling cloak. Hmm. I wonder how much... I think 16 gold, I think, would cost me. Ooh, that's almost worth it, especially with this rain. But I think not. Okay. Now, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. All right, what else can you do? Uh, blacksmith, I'm in need of your expertise. Hmm. And this makes what? Just more things. Okay, barbarian armor. No, thank you. That looks just terrible. What else? Highwayman mail. That's interesting, but it costs 90. I don't really have the money for that. And more imperial armor. Oh, you could make leather armor, could you? For 125 gold. Uh, no thank you. Or, oh, you could make Nord Mail, could you? For 225 I don't even have enough money for that, so... I think not. Ring Mail. This is all... quite expensive. Studded armor, yeah. What about weapons? Is it the same price to make a steel sword as it was to buy one? Probably. Oh no, 45 gold only to make me a steel sword. As opposed to buy one for, I think it was 137? That seems... That seems a little crazy. Yeah, see, 275 for the Cyrodiilic steel sword. That seems a little bit... That makes more sense, actually. Ooh, I'd like this short sword, actually. I I see Samuel as more of a, a short sword user than a long sword, but... Hmm. I'm tempted. I'm tempted to have you make this steel sword, but you know what? Never mind, for right now, okay? You keep banging away on that. Um, I did find out, however, there's a general goods trader over here. That's who I really need to visit so I can sell. He wouldn't buy much, you see, Alvor. He would only buy, you know, weapons and armor, which I didn't have a lot of. So let's go see what's going on in the Riverwood Trader. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. Hmm? No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. I... We are done talking about this. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, hi. Sorry you had to hear that. Yeah, I, I'm sorry for interrupting, really, even though this is, uh, you know, a shop. But... That's okay to air your drama in front of everyone. That's good business, right? Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. You're well, free to shop. okay, good. That's good. The Riverwood Trader is everything you need in a general store. But I gotta be honest. Now you've you've kind of got me curious. What what was all that about that I walked into? You know, you guys were the ones that decided to 
argue about it in front of potential customers, so go ahead. Tell me all about it. Uh, yeah, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. A break-in? Oh. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. Oh, what were they after? An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Hmm, okay. I could help you get the claw back. Why would I want to do that? I... What? Come on. Where's... Uh, uh, I could help you get the claw back, I guess. Is there a reward? Is there money involved? You could? I've got some coin coming in from okay, my Okay, that's what I'm talking about. It's yours if you bring my claw back. I might need the money. Who knows? If you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northwest of town. Bleak Falls Barrow. So this is your plan, Lucan? Oh. Yes. Hi. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... I really don't. Eight. Fine. Because I'm not... Only to the edge of town. I really don't need a guide, because I'm probably not going to go. But, uh... You're... You're just going to go anyway, aren't you? Okay, that's fine. Um, hi, again. Show those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valerius. No, okay. Do you sell spells? Yes, that's a good question. I think I have a few old spell books laying about. All right. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. College of Winterhold? What is this? And what do you have? Well, read a rusty Cyrodiilic iron short sword. Damage seven. What's mine do? Eight. Yeah, I think. No. Yeah, see, look at that. 137 for a steel sword. Oh, you've got a brown fur backpack, though. Now that... That would be useful. I might have to... Hmm. I'm going to have to think about that. What else? Circlet of Minor Destruction. See now, circlets. That is something that Sam would wear. A circlet. He's used to wearing circlets and crowns and things. But Minor Destruction, that doesn't really help me very much. So how about not? Knapsacks, no thank you. Noble trim wolfskin hood ice. Well, hood might be nice. Keep the rain off my noggin. Bearskin cloak. In this weather, I don't really think so, to be honest. And you've got burlap travel cloaks. I kind of would really like this backpack, but again, 150 gold. I, I really don't think so. Spell tomes. Frostbite. Fury. Now, I've thought about training in illusion, but I gotta be honest, I'm not a big fan of illusion spells. I've never had much success with them. I think I'm gonna skip it. Oak Flesh. Now that I would like to have. 134. Man. Soothe. Exposure is reduced by 10 for 30 seconds. When the effect wears off, the exposure is gained again. That's for Frostfall. I don't think I really need that right now either. Boy's Blue Tunic. Okay. Don't know why I would need that. Oh, you sell a fur crafting kit so I could make my own cloaks. Except that I don't have the slightest idea how to make things. So no thank you. I've got a couple of empty water skins for water. What can I sell you? That's really more what I'm interested in. Oh, see, look. You'll buy all these cloaks. Definitely do that. I don't want any storm cloak cloaks. You take all of those. I don't need my foot wraps anymore. I realize you're not giving me any money for them, but that's fine. Yeah, you can have that. And that. 
that also. And why don't you buy this ring? It was Elvor's, but I don't think I'm going to need it for anything, so you can have it. Uh, what else? Um, I got to keep all that stuff. Mixed, you oh, books. You know what? Buy sparks. I don't think I'm ever going to learn sparks. And I'm going to keep those other books right now. Going to need all that food. And I more than likely will need those potions. What am I up to now? $4.99? Heck yeah. In that case, why don't you... Give me not this backpack. I don't know that I'm going to need that just yet. I might be on my way back home here pretty soon. But I will take oak flesh. Give me that. So in case I run into any trouble along the way, I'll have it. I could afford the steel sword now. But you know what? This iron sword that I picked up is not doing me too bad, so I think we're good. Visit the College of Winterhold. Yes, I might have to do that, actually. Till next time. Okay. Alright, so we've got a spell to learn now. Where are you? Yes! Oak flesh. Learned. Okay. So, let's favorite that. Um, also, I would like... Oh, healing is favorited. Look at me. I'm smart. Um, okay. Actions I need. I don't know what that does. So I'm going to leave it. Um, I've noticed that... Here, I'm going to... I'm going to try this, actually. Let's see what happens. What would you like to do? Status. I am a bit hungry. I'm a bit thirsty. I'm a bit fatigued. Well, where's my... Where's my little icons in the corner, then? To tell me that. Roast options. Options. Restart. No. Miscellaneous. Needs. Rates, volume, horse. Adjust the rates, volume, automate, change the written perspective. Okay, I don't want to do that. The problem that I have is that it's not showing. It's not showing up in the corner when I'm hungry or thirsty. Ah, well, I'll work on that later. Anyway, all right, Luke and Valerius, good day to you. Thank you for everything. Oh, wait, I'm not done yet. I need to favorite some of this stuff. All right, let's put that there. Uh, oak flesh there. Should probably put my sword. Nope, that oh that I already had a four, didn't I? Alright, five. Four. Okay. We got that. Four. And got oak flesh. Healing. And I can always go back to just the sword. Okay, good. All right, sorry for loitering. Okay, see you later. We have to go town the oh, God, you're still here? All right. You can see it from here, though. Yeah, no, I know about it. Okay. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. Okay. Are you just going to wait there till I fall? Uh, let's humor the poor girl. Uh, hi. Hello. All right. Hello, chicken. Sorry. I'm lagging behind a little bit. I apologize. I wonder why they only stole Lincoln's golden claw. 
Hmm, I wonder. Yes. Mm-hmm. Lupin found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. Ah. Yeah. Okay. So, how about this weather, huh? It's really coming down. This is the bridge out of town. Mm -hmm. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. Yep, He'll sure should. Fit if I take too long. He's such a child. No, okay. Yep. Go ahead. I'll just, uh, I'll continue on to Bleak Falls Barrow. Over there, like you said. All right. Have a good day, then. Now the question is, how long do I have to wait here until she's convinced that I'm going off and doing that for her? Because... We're not, we're not going to Bleak Falls Barrow. Okay. I think we've waited long enough. I think she's gone. Let's go check out the rest of the town and then we'll head on. Oh, there she is. Dang it. That's fine. I don't think she can see us. We'll just go slow. We'll go slow. She's headed back to the store. Hopefully she won't look this way. And she can just continue on thinking that we went to save the day. Okay, she went back inside. What's this then? What does that say? The Sleeping Giant Inn. All right. Let's check it out. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, hello to you too, Embry. That's how you introduce yourself to people? Rude. Hard not to. Oh god. We need to get a new batch. Did you hear me? Yep, ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. I don't even know you. Come on in. But I already don't like you. Just don't start singing, okay? No singing. None. Okay, we clear? All right. Anyway, Sleeping Giant Inn. What we have been sitting in that barrel. Very nice. Yep. And you'll take care of it? Don't I always? I don't suppose I could convince you to take Why care of it why are all the shopkeepers so rude no. in this town? Hello? Well, there's something to be said for honesty, I suppose. You have a customer. Hello. Once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding What did I say? Hey. And the braggart did swagger and Hey. Feindolf thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Okay. Hey, can I make a request? Sure. What can I do for you? Go away. Sure. My voice could use a rest. Yes, it could for the rest of your life. Thank you. Okay, back to you two rude individuals. Drink Let's too. not all talk I at cook. once, okay? Ain't much else to tell. Hi, Orgnar. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. Okay. I, I don't think I'll be needing a room, but... Um, uh, heard any rumors? Rumors are always good. There have been whispers. A boy up in Windhelm, name of Aventus Aretino. Been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. A boy... A boy in in Windhelm. Come on, give me give me something useful. Come on. Have you seen that shrine of Azura? No. They say the Dark Elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Sight to see. All right. I mean, if I get up that way, that somewhat interesting. Um. Yeah. Yes. Could you give me some water, dear sir? Of course. Thank you. Very much. Um, 
I'm looking for work. Got any leads? Um, yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, I... Just in case. Just in case I need a little extra gold. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Bounty bandits added. Kill the bandit leader located at Silent Moon's camp. Bandits. You want me to kill bandits? Do I look like a mercenary to you? You know what? Don't answer that. Actually, I forgot. I'm... I'm dressed as an Imperial soldier, aren't I? I mean, I am an Imperial soldier. I am an Imperial soldier, Orgnar. And I will happily take care of those bandits for you. You're welcome. On behalf of the great em Emperor Titus Mead, of course. Right. Forgot about that. Okay, what do you got for sale, Orgnar? Let's sate that appetite. Hmm? Hmm? Oh my, many things. Beef stew, yummy. Uh, how much money do I have? 360. Um, venison stew. Yeah, all right, give me that. That sounds good. Um, potato soup, sure. Porker stew, that sounds gross. Uh, clam chowder. Heck yeah, give me that. Cabbage potato, no thank you. All right, I think that'll do, I guess. Uh, for now, is there anything I can sell you? Not really, just, uh, just some salt. Well, all right, I think I'm gonna get going. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you are Delphine. I'm the innkeeper. Yes. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Okay. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. Really? I wonder why. Probably because everyone that I've seen that owns a shop here is rude as hell. That's probably why. I'd like to rent a room. Uh, no, I think I'm good uh, for now. Have you heard, have you, I mean, heard any rumors lately, Miss Delphine? They say a dragon attacked Helgen. Yes. Sounds like hogwash to me. It's not. I was there. It was horrible. Okay. That's all you got, huh? I mean, I guess that's probably pretty big news around here. The war keeps most folks away these days. Okay. This place is pretty boring, I gotta admit. Thank you for not singing anymore. I appreciate that, Sven. Um, goodbye. Wait a minute, though. Can I ask you something? Feindolf thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Yeah, that's... I wanted to talk to you about that. Camilla Valerius, we we just met her. That's, uh... The lady that led us to... How to get to Bleak Falls Barrow that we then totally ignored. So... Yeah, wh what's going on with this? You and, and Feindolf, you're both... You're both into this Camilla lady? Camilla Valerius knows I'm the best man in Riverwood. Are you? That elf is kidding himself if he thinks she would choose him over me. Mm. I've seen him sneaking over to the Riverwood trader to speak with her when I'm not around. He's wasting his time. Hmm, you think so, huh? Two people spending time together never... Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is sarcastic, is it? Yes, two people spending time together never blossoms into courtship. He sounds persistent. Why not do something about it? Yes! Why not do something about it, Sven? You may be right. Camilla may see Feindel as little more than a friend. But why take chances? That's give, not really what I meant. Give Camilla this letter. It's full of venomous nonsense. Tell her it's from Feindel. Why on earth would I do that? I don't, I don't care about this little love triangle you guys have going on. So where did you learn to play so terribly, anyway? At the Bard's College in Solitude. Mm. They train bards and skulls like myself. Mm. Okay. If you go there, talk to Viarmo. Nope. He's the headmaster. Nope. Not doing any of that, but thanks. Is there somewhere I can buy fresh supplies? I think I've figured that out, so I'm going to leave you to your business, all right? Until next time. Yeah. Okay, see ya. Okay. I see it's 
still an absolutely wonderful day out here, so that's good. Is there anything else in this tiny town to do? Probably not. It's not a very big place, to be fair. Well... Perhaps it's time to head out then. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. All right. Goodbye, Riverwood. We shall meet again later. Maybe. Well, hopefully not. Anyway, okay. <laughs> A smelly town full of smelly Nords. Man, I can't wait to get out of this God's forsaken place. I can't believe there are actually people who choose to live here. This is a horrible place. It's cold. It's rainy. Oh, oh, that's not good. All right, we got a little wolf here. Let's get my wolf out here to kill it. Oh, you, man. Oh, oh God. Why are you running away? What the hell? Oh, here he comes. All right, where's the other one? Get him. Get him, Wolfie. Yes. Yes. Ha! Didn't see that coming. Wolf pelt, I'll take it. After all that work, Kill you, why not sell it for a bit of coin, I say. Alright. Well, that wasn't so bad, I guess. A couple of mangy wolves. So. Alright. Oh, what? Oh, dear. Imperials. Uh, and I'm dressed like an Imperial. This, okay, this is bad. This is... This is bad. Alright, we're just gonna... Uh, <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> Hello! Yes, comrades. Good day to you. I'm just, uh... Just, uh, headed, uh... Headed, uh... No, 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 citizen. No, I... Yes, I understand. Okay. I'm just headed, uh, out... Northeast, uh, 40 clicks... To reconnoiter, uh... Quadrant... 2739B. Uh, that away. Looking for hostiles. So, good day to you, and uh, good hunting. And, uh, Semper Fi for the Empire. <laughs> I think they bought it. <laughs> Woo! That was a close one. Hunting Brew Meadery. Okay. I'm assuming that's White Run. Over there. All right. What's that? I hear something. Sounds like battle. Oh my gosh, it is. Get in there, Wolfie. Giant, oh my goodness. Oh, must have scared them. Well, we got him. Nice job, everybody. You handle yourself well. You can oh. make for a decent shield, brother. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, you like that, did you? Ayla. Ayla's your name, huh? Nice to meet you. Hi, Sam. Hi. <laughs> I know, you know, I've, uh. <clears throat> 
I've had a bit of practice, <laughs> you know, in my day. I'm glad you, glad you enjoyed the show, you know. Uh, no charge, no charge. <laughs> anyway, uh, Shield Brother, what's, uh, what's this business? Never heard of that before. Sounds crazy. An outsider, eh? Mm-hmm, yeah. Ever heard of the Companions? An order no. of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. Brothers and sisters, and we show huh? Up to solve problems if the coin is given. Okay, okay. I'm not going to... Oh, that's... That's no. A, a, a beautiful lady is talking to us. We're not going to say it sounds like a waste of time. That sounds mean. I'm not really interested in joining up, but... Let's play along. See where this goes, shall we? <laughs> Can I join you? Not for me to say. Mm. You'll have to talk to Codlack Whitemane. Codlack. Okay. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your worth. All right. Yeah, I'll, uh, if you go to him, good luck. I'll, I'll go see him, you know, if I, if I have the time when I'm not, uh, you know, killing other uh, giants and uh, dragons, flaming things of evil. You know, uh, I... Couldn't help but notice you're still walking away. That's fine. We'll we'll talk later. That's cool. I understand. You got you got places to go. I get that. All right. Iron arrows. Why not? Sure, I'll take them. All right. That's not too bad. <laughs> hey, Sam. We faked our way through an imperial uh, imperial. Uh, thing over there talk to a pretty lady hey there enjoy the view while Find I'm walking away all right okay what the hell is this by Eastmere it's true a jester funny suit and all just north by the Loria's farm fool had a coffin in a cart with a broken wheel I'd like to see him laugh his way out of that <laughs> <laughs> What well, the hell is wrong with you guys? Like you've had quite the journey, Uthgar. But you were gone longer than usual. I got to thinking maybe you weren't coming back. You sound like my ma. Figured I was lying dead in a field somewhere, is that it? Thought did cross my mind, yeah. War brewing, talk of a riot in Helgen, that Mount Jester's. Skyrim's gone mad, girl. Hi, hi, I apologize for eavesdropping. Careful, huh? Thanks, Skullbar. I'll remember that. <laughs> yeah, right. You guys are just having a good old time out here, aren't you? Okay, what is this place? What is this? Unlock Maiden Loom Matter. Huh. Okay. It's a place that belongs to somebody by the name of Maiden Loom. Uthgird. Want to hear a little Nord wisdom? All right. You don't really know a woman till you've had a strong drink and a fist fight with her. Okay, thank you for that, I guess. Oh! What the? Need something? No, I'm good, Grush Nag. We got some Khajiits over here. What a, do you want? a Khajiit caravan, actually. You honor Khajiits with your presence. Oh, okay. Thanks, I, I guess. Um, I don't think I have anything to sell, or you probably don't have anything that I'm interested in buying, so I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna carry on. Thank you, though. Anyway, all right. This white one... white one... white run, excuse me, place. Keep walking, <laughs> soft guy. I'm more woman than you can handle. I have no doubt that that's probably true, but could you could you hold off on the insults? Seriously. Soft gut? Was that necessary? I don't think so. It's not very nice. All right. This white run place is a happening place, I was going to say. All right. Halt. Okay. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. All right. Well, it's a good thing that I'm on official business then. Mr. Guard, you jerk. Yeah, I have news from Helgen about the dragon attack. Actually, if you'd let me through, please, you peon. 
fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Keeping an eye on me? You Nords are strange. You really are. Hi there. How you doing? Brigands, I can handle. This talk of dragons? World gone mad, I say. Yep, you're all gonna die. Enjoy that. Okay. Fight with him. White run discovered. Thinking I need to train some more. All right. Then go ahead and do it and stop bothering me. Thank you. Well, we made it to we'll White Run. Whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial I got no soldiers. quarrel with you, but I, just I won't can't turn fill one an order down that either. size on my own. And we've what discovered that everyone in White Run talks at the same time. <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric Storm. So that's great. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Okay. It's also, wow, 8 p.m. Holy shnikes. Well. I think what I'm going to do. Iron sword, huh? What are you killing? Butterflies? Nice, thanks. I think what I'm going to do is see if I can find a place to turn in for the evening and uh, we'll visit this Jarl in the morning. You know, we've had a long day. It's been a rough one. And we made it to civilization, finally. So let's put our feet up and enjoy the relaxation a little bit. That's what I think. Sounds like a good idea. <laughs> 